all right so welcome to today's tutorial we have another tutorial now we are going to be designing a wedding flyer uh, more like a wedding design what you're seeing on your screen now this is what we are going to be designing today so please before we start remember remember to subscribe like and share and now let's go straight into it so i'm using photoshop and i've already set <coughs> my screen resolution to 300 and my um, workspace um, document is in 300 resolution dpi and 7 by 7 inches and also i've been able to, ahead of time so i will not waste time and i'm going ahead to get the images that i will be using for this flyer design so it is always necessary that when you start or when you before you start designing that you go ahead and make you know kind of research about what you're about to design so before for that therefore that I'm sorry let's that design so this couple have already removed Around and everything, so it's really easy for us. Now, what we're we'll doing now is just trying to place and get the proper of it. And then I'll be using this aspect. So, everything I'm going to be working with is going to be the same color in two minutes. Yes. So, I'm um, going we'll send this to the back. Right. So, I will work on the tune to match the tune of this. So that is what I'm So I will take shift the hue uh, until I feel like I've gotten exactly what I want. Okay. And work on the saturation a bit. Uh, right. So I think I'm okay with this. Oh, all right then. I'm gonna work on. I will make it blow using blow remember it doesn't need to be perfect at first so just walk your way around it and see what you can achieve and then i'm going to use it i'm going to be using a tune curve to work on the background to make it a bit dark hope you, hope you understand so i want it to be a bit darker Oops. I think I'm okay with this. And also, I'm going to be to carving the image also to um, you know, give it a kind of um, color to tune in the color a bit. Understand? Alright. Okay. I think um, for now I am okay with this. So, another thing I'm going to be working on is. On this um, green stuff, also, I'm gonna be fine tuning the color to actually fit in within this so that we don't lose our team, our color, where we might understand. So, I think this is okay, and I will okay. Now I'm gonna change the blend mode. Now remember, I I actually sat down and thought I've already have in mind what I want to achieve before now. So before you start designing, you have to make your research. How do I want my design to look like? What what am I trying to achieve? These are things you ask. So that's what I actually did, and then I had to arrive at this. I've not tried them, so I'm trying them out now. If anyone seems not to give me what I actually want I send it out this you, you must not get it the right right way the first time so I'm still trying because what I want to do with this um, image is I want to blend it um, and then also blow it let me blow it first um, with a gazium blow and see what I I can achieve with it. Um, okay. Not too bad. I'll make 
pinkies. What did you say the beats? I'm trying to make it not become too low. So you can see within that. And let me use the tongue to go to see what I can actually get from this. Hope you, hope, hope you understanding this this whole process is how I'm trying to show you is there is no um a particular way there's no particular way to this as a whole. So I think um, I'm gonna stick with this and also I want to spill part of this background. So, uh, I don't know how it's gonna go. So don't mind my system, my system is lagging, it's not that powerful. So I think I can bring it to the top. No, sorry, duplicate it. Country J. And bring it to the top. And from here, I think I'm gonna match it. Also, then my brush to let me let's see what we can get. Start fitting in the text. We'll start, we'll start fitting in, in the text. So, I'll, the text I'm going to be using is V and shoes. So, alright, so I'm going to work on one day that I'll duplicate it to form the other one. Then I'll also go to blend mode to um, blend it option to work on it. So I'll double click on it, then visit the blending option to you know, get um, the more. Listen, so I'm going to be working on the glue part of it. Um, is my outer glue okay then uh, all right so i want to reduce the opacity for the glue a bit and 
use the size. So once I add it, I want to add another kind of glue to it, which maybe I will use as um, a drop shadow. You understand? So let me use a drop shadow. Or let me, let's try inner glue first. Change the color to somewhat green. See what it gives us. Opposite. Okay, it is not coming up the way I want. So I think I need to still go with the drop shadow and check. Now well, these things are kind of experiment. So to see what we can get from it. Okay, and I think I just have to stick with the um, outer glue and also So that I can be able to see the hand in it. In the hand, I will remove this hairstyle and fit it into this place. So now, all these things are choices that you can make. I will select both of them and make sure that it is sent 
card and I think I'll just really shift it a bit then I will make it a bit bigger and then um, I have something I can turn this circle instead of just being plain like this maybe I'll just add um, a kind of a blend mode to it um, save sorry gradient to valley so I'll just choose this and make it lighter green and choose this other one and make it darker and start to I will delete this circle yes, this one so it has removed an original color Right, so what I'll do is change the angle and scale it a bit and shoot this like this. Okay. Now, I think we are getting to somewhere. Now, what I'm going to do now is this, um, this whole stuff, okay, with shoes. Where are shoes? Okay. I'm gonna put them together and name them Dex Couples Name. Okay, and then I'll reduce it a bit. Because what's gonna come down is the date now. So what I'll put in the date, what I'll do to the date is I will I have to um, write a random date to it. No, these are things that you actually put in a wedding stop so people can actually go with this one. It's good. So I will create this. I will use a rectangle. to draw you the box right it or just use to increase the spacing of it. The spacing is, is too compacted so I have to reduce it. Okay. And maybe go down a bit. Okay. Then okay, center. Then increase this one a bit. So what next I'll do is I'll do these two stuff. And give it a shadow so that it can come out very well. So I will give it a shadow, and I think that way it should be able to come out well. And I think we'll be good to go. All right, so I'll increase the opacity, increase the spread, increase the size. So that is not too much. So I'm really the most. So after a little tweaking, I think I am okay with it. All right. So the next thing we are going to do is we are going to write the title on top of it. So um before I go there, I think I should check some custom shape um so that I can know if I can get any stuff from this. Oh, wow. Okay. 
I don't think I need any of these words at all. Um, God, I'll check this. I'm trying to know if I can get something. It's okay. But since there is none, what I'm just gonna do is just duplicate this. Bring it here. Um, saturate. I think I need to rasterize it and desaturate. Tweak it. Okay. Then this the opacity is very well. I want to take it to the back. What I'll now do now is I will take this one, this one, the couple's name, duplicate them and bring them up here. Okay, and I want to put them on. Okay, I'll let me just say um, I just need let me use this. So let me just delete this. The couple names. I'll control G and bring it up outside the group folder. So once I take it out, what I want to do is V shoes 20 hashtag hashtag where is my hashtag? Sorry, hashtag V shoes. So I'll reduce it very very small. I want it to be small, very small, but not this small. I have to increase it a bit. Okay, and what's the need? And what we do is spreading it. So now you can see that with this little tweaking, tweaking, and tweaking, and tweaking, we'll be able to get something like this. Okay, I'm trying to see if gradient map can do anything to this. Where will I can just select something, something, understand? Um, orange stuff. And try to know if there's something I can do about it. I'm just saying, I don't know how it will look like. There's no army. Let me try. Okay. Let me say, can you subscribe to my channel? See it adds a little, a little of it to it. Thank you. 
rushed to. So with this, I hope you've been able to learn a lot. Thank you and see you next time.